All right, guys, gray, silvery hair. Do I keep it or not? Stay tuned to find out what happens. Whoosh. My Drew House slippers cover it. <laughs> let's pick an outfit. No, no. Ooh. Okay, let's wear the kids' Versace today. Yoink. Good morning, bugaboos. How are you guys doing today? I'm off to a nail appointment. You guys might see that my nails are like all janky and jacked up. Basically, I've been like trying to like take them off. I need to take them off. It's not gonna be a long appointment, but I'm just getting some gel polish, but not on all of them. This sounds so confusing. I just rather show you. <laughs> Anyways, and I'm, I'm doing a food challenge today because I know you guys love them. Okay, besties. My nails are so bad, but at least we kept Piglet here and Piglet here. I've been trying to take them off. <laughs> Before and after. I know it looks so different. Look at my little short nails. Look at this. I have not been able to make a fist in years, like a full fist. Well, like without stabbing my, like, <laughs> this feels so weird going like this. So these are my natural nails. Oh my god, I just like came and like looked right in my car like bye. They just have gel polish over top of them and on my index fingers have absolutely no product whatsoever because I am having surgery right away to have my breast implants exchanged and renewed and refreshed. I've had them in for over 13 years. It is time besties. I'm gonna do a whole video and series on that if you guys want to see that, which I've already asked you and you do. I just actually posted episode episode one over on my Pink Sparkles channel. You can go in the description box down below and grab the link and go check it out. I reveal exactly what I'm getting done, where I'm going, what country, what surgeon, everything. So go check out episode one, cuties. I'm just getting prepared. My appointment was today anyway to get like my nails done. So I was like, may as well just take them off today. I'm just gonna have my natural nails for a bit. At least I have some color on the rest. They just need to monitor. You know when they need to put the clip on here? They need to see like my blood flow and stuff like that. I don't know, but anyway. Okay, I just looked it up. It's to monitor your oxygen levels in your blood. That's it. <laughs> Sad, but true. <laughs> I'm just gonna do a cameo in the car here because I just got requested for one. And then I'm gonna pick up my stuff for my lunch challenge, which I'm excited for. <laughs> I'm just down the baking aisle, getting some salt because I'm not salty enough, I guess. <laughs> Sad about my nails, but you know, whatever. We'll get them back one day. And it's good to let my nails have a break because I did actually have a lot of damage on my natural nails, so. Good to give him a break. What are you doing? What? What are you doing? Cleaning up the dog poop. Yeah. The ah, thank you. You're welcome, baby. You do the dirty work. Yeah, usually. <laughs> Me and the Versace shirt are going inside. <laughs> I wanna give you guys a little update on Benny's nose. So I started a little folder. Also, it's so weird with depth, per depth perception. I'm like scratching my eye and I'm like, scratching my eye like this because my nails used to be like this long. So I'm like, oh, okay. Also this kid's Versace sweater fits me perfectly. If I'm gonna buy more like um, designer clothes, it's always gonna be kids because like it's comfy. I'm not like constrained, constrained in it. <laughs> It's so weird going like this. Like my fingers haven't bent like this in so long. It's like, oh, it feels like, oh, so good. Oh, it's like orgasmic. Um, anyways, Benny, <laughs> you guys remember um, this vlog right here. I will link it down below. I tell you guys like a full diagnosis or whatever. But um, I posted on Snapchat one day this photo and a lot of you guys were really concerned about his nose, as were we. He was diagnosed with a thyroid condition. One of the symptoms for him, I should say, is was hair loss. Um, it was mainly on his nose, but there was other places as well, which I show in that video if you're curious, but that's where you mo notice it most, right? Cause it's like right on his face. But I wanna show you some progress pictures here. So as I'm talking, um, this was that day, like he pretty much lost like almost all the hair on his like snout, I guess you would call it. So exactly a month later, you can see that his hair has like grown back like 
almost half of his snout has grown back in like a month. He's been taking to the medication very well. This was just like a couple days after that picture I just showed you. And like there's even more hair growth. And then this was yesterday. So his hair is growing back so, so much better. And all over his body. It is still a little bit thin in some parts. The medication is definitely helping. And I'm so happy for Benny for getting his um, coat back. Especially because it's, you can tell the weather's changing. And we're getting colder. So he needs his coat. Yay! So yay! Yay for Benny! Yay for Benny! Woo! He hates being filmed, but this is today as I'm editing this. Oh, there we go. Look at your growth. Look at it, you guys. His meds have been working beautifully, and he's been getting salmon oil as well added to his diet, and it's helping him. He loves rolling around in the dirt, so, um... <laughs> yes, we give him regular baths. Don't even. Look at it! Yay for Benjamin! Benjamin! Hell yeah, Benadryl. Woo! So to get a better look at it, here is October 7th and his growth. Now let's compare from when he barely had any hair on his nose to about two and a half months later. Amazing progress, Benjamin! I'm not a regular mom, I'm a cool mom. It's just regular. I don't know, I feel like my fingers look stubby. <laughs> and I always say, it's good to let my nails breathe and I can hear my haters in my head being like, your nails don't have lungs. <laughs> How do you know? Are you my nails? Them. <laughs> the water cycle. <laughs> Spider. Okay, guys, editing this, I found this so funny. I have to show you. Apparently, I forgot to use this intro. I forgot I filmed this, and I just found it while editing this vlog. So this was supposed to be the intro for my hair reveal, which is just a different shade of blonde. So <laughs> here it is. Hey, guys. <laughs> I changed my hair color. I don't want to show it to you guys right now, but I want to say welcome to the vlog. But it's giving E.T. It's giving E.T. in the basket. So <laughs> Back to living my E.T. life. So I got my hair bleached. We get a big hair reveal now. Ah! Like, anyways, I used this intro for that other vlog that you guys previously watched. This is what I used for it. Hey, everyone. Welcome to the vlog. I'm unboxing something crazy. Not really crazy, but... Hello. <laughs> I feel like I should have used the ET one. <laughs> Anyways, back to this vlog. Hey, Sophie, you haven't been in the vlog for a while. Why are you backing away? Oh, well, that's rude. She's like, I do not consent. I all of a sudden started feeling like sick. Like stomachs, like pukey sick. I don't know. What the heck? Maybe I ate something bad or I don't know. Blech. Also, this shirt here, if you didn't see my haul, it is a kid's sweater. And did I say that already? Let's wear the kids Versace today. Me and the Versace shirt are going inside. This kids Versace sweater fits me perfectly. I feel like I've been saying everything twice today. Something's going on with my brain funky today. I just want to go sit and edit and I don't feel like it. I don't know. I think I just need to like lay down. <laughs> this nail's like cut or broken like straight across like my natural nail because it was lifting so badly. Um, I like yanked it and it like ripped my nail in half. Cool. This one here has a little crack here. She fixed all of them, by the way. She like did the like band-aid trick, the nail bandage trick, not an actual band-aid. And then this one here was also had a crack. And so it's good that I am giving my nails a break. And then this gives them a little bit more security. So it's good. <sighs> Sophie's coming back up. Telfie. Selfie! She's like, I'm back. You don't tell me when I go on. I tell everyone when I'm coming on. Right, Delphi? Right, Delphi? <laughs> so majestic. Ooh, look at your little belly. But I'm happy about my hair. I'm happy about my hair. Okay, so I accidentally deleted the whole clip of me explaining whether I'm keeping the hair or not. Good on me! When I first got it done, I was happy about it. So she wanted to try something a little different to my hair. I love it. It's so cute! I'm low-key obsessed. I've always wanted like silvery grayish purple hair. But as the day went on, I was starting to have second thoughts. I didn't really like the shade it was. By the end of the night, I really disliked it, honestly. Um, my hair's darker today. So tomorrow I'm getting it fixed. It's like purple, brown. Not brown, sorry. I, I call it gunmetal gray. And I think it doesn't suit me also. It's just not what I like. It's a no for me. The next day I put on some makeup and I got a little bit more used to it. And I actually started really, really liking it, but I still had time to decide whether I was going to my appointment to get it back to my regular shade of blonde. It's just a different shade. That's all. There was nothing wrong with it. I was going to change my hair color, but I think I love it. I think I love it. I think it's like cute. I think I'm going to keep it. I feel like vampire vibes. I see. So I decided to keep it. Why not? Why not have a little bit of change? The next time I get my hair done, I'm going to go back to what I usually get. But it was nice to switch up my hair and give myself a different look. At the end of the day, it's just hair. It's not that big of a deal. There are more important 
important things in life and having a gray tinge for a few months is not a big deal and I'm actually living for it. I might do it again one day. <laughs> but I deleted this clip of me saying this. So anyways, fail sparkles here. Resuming the day. <laughs> oh, it's the surprise I just found. Oh, look at them. Oh my gosh. Look how cute they are. Oh, they're like a little burrito. I thought this was just a folded up blanket. Oh. Okay, it's hug time. It's hug time. No, it's hug time. It's hug time. Oh, wow. <laughs> it's hug time. <laughs> Ooh. Hug time. I also got Benny a latte. I don't know if I showed you guys this, but. Wait, where's it? You want a latte, Benny? Puppuccino? One puppuccino. Whoa. Why is it so blur? <laughs> One puppuccino. Why is this squeaker like ass? Coming right up. Served. We have to pay first. Thank you. Here's your puppuccino. <laughs> you choose a puppuccino over fries? Wow. You're on one. I would never. I'm icing my nail with my lip filler <laughs> ice pack because it's easy to like bend. This nail is like swollen and hurts. Pain is beauty. Beauty is pain. Mm. Oh, the sunset. Didn't know how, but I always had a feeling I was gonna be that one in a million. Got to have high hopes. Mama said, okay. Make it supper. Make it supper. Make it supper. <laughs> there. I think about right here. What do you think? Yes. Yeah. It'll look cute there. Okay. I can see where my greasy finger left the mark. <laughs> what are you chewing on? Um, these things just help you set in a new set of aligners. Oh. Just put them into place. So. Oh. They told me to just chew on it for the first couple minutes. This is the new friend if you didn't see my haul. So it's just gonna go somewhere downstairs? Yay! We hung him up. We're just trying to think of a name for him. Terry? Terry! Terry? And what do you think, Terry? Yes. I'm drinking hot chocolate this morning. <laughs> Absolutely adorable. Look at that sloth hanging out. Austin just secured our new child with one of these that we got a Dollarama. Holla Dollarama! And he's gonna stay up, right? <laughs> So cute! Do you think it's a good placement? Does it complement the air fryer? <laughs> okay, I tried. Quick review. These. UF's Bacon at Fribbles. Uh, okay, they're new. They're breakfast pockets. I was not a fan. There's a much better breakfast. Just crack two eggs, put some bacon in a pan. The eggs were really soft, had no flavor. The bacon was super chewy. These just were not a hit, okay? No, no. Pass on these. Bye. Look at my baby bell. There's the Cheshire Cat. <laughs> I felt a red flag somewhere in my head. Most people's pet peeve is this of mine. How it open chip bags if they're like, I'm not gonna stick my hand all the way down. So I go like this and I rip <laughs> wherever it naturally rips. <laughs> and then, yes, you gonna rip there? Great. So then I just hold it down, lead over this. And that has been so many people's pet peeves of mine that I eat snacks with and then I'll just like fold it in. I have always done that and then I make like a little bowl. I mean, maybe some of you guys might be like, oh, that's cool, I'm gonna try that. Or like, why wouldn't you just get up and get a bowl, you lazy ass, but this, so quick, you don't need to get scissors. And it's like its own little bowl. Sometimes I've ripped it straight down, chips has fallen out. I just fold it over and make, try to make the bowl anyway, so. <laughs> Another way to hate me. Just kidding. Mm. I asked for Austin to bring me back a chocolate bar and he's like, which one? And I could, I was like, I don't know what I'm craving. He literally bought me one of like every chocolate bar, like one of everything to satisfy any needs, like pure chocolate, some with bubbles, flaky chocolate, caramel, cookies and cream, a nougat, like everything, yum. And then I spent the whole rest of the night editing and packing to get ready for our flight for the next day so that I could have my plastic surgery. So the next vlog is a travel vlog and I can't wait to show you what we did and our journey. But I was editing so much, I forgot to end the vlog. So I'm just sharing with you guys one of my favorite clips of this huge cotton candy and it failing. <laughs> I know I'm really behind on vlogs, but I had surgery and I was out of the country for almost almost two weeks, but I am catching up now and I cannot wait to show you guys some travel vlogs. And I know this vlog was kind of all over the place, but I just wanted to get it out of the way so we can start fresh, start with travel vlogs and reveal to you my new look and get all the old stuff out of the way. And I will talk to you guys in the next video. Bye.